And here we are back at the hero's hideaway. I guess we come for a full circle back to the beginning of the game. Something about this area is different from the others we've explored so far. Oh no. Wait, where are you running off to? Yeah. What the heck? There's a blue pigman that just tripped on himself. That can't be a good sign. The pigmen don't usually scurry off like that. I suppose I'll have to call them back while you search for the mis missing ship parts. I don't know why they wanted to just leave. Like, if I remember correctly, I knew there were some back there. Um... Yeah, we got those. And... I guess now we just fall. I don't hear anything. What? I don't even have to worry about moss. Oh, hello. I should have more. I don't know. I don't know where the ship parts are. Um, let's get these children and then these children. Oh, I see you. You know, hiding. <laughs> that guy's just sleeping. I just realized I don't have a, a a day. I don't even know what it's called. The thing that tracks the progress of the day. I don't know. Or the time of day, I guess. Is it eating a ship part? I don't know. I know he did before. radio we located it at last with this back in my possession i can finally call for help what are you you weren't there before huh when did that creature show up would it be the reason why the pikmin and the onion are acting so weird i oh maybe i guess i have nowhere to put this so I highly doubt they can they can just ride the fan. Alright, well let me get these Pikmin over here. And then I'll take that guy on. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. That was a big yawn. Goodness, the Pikmin and Onion seem to be back to normal. Now it's time to transport that precious interstellar radio. Uh, where? How? What? I guess we can take care of these rocks. Because I don't know why. Because we can't even move. We can't even move this thing. Oh, there's my clock. Oh, okay. So the guy was um, interfering with that, I guess. Oh, my children. Come on, my children. I'll go up here. seen any hiding um I guess while they're doing that let's go ahead and transport this guy because why not
there's supposed to be a thing here. And I don't know how I activate that. I don't know. I see that guy. What the heck? Why is he up there? Let's deal with all these little guys down here. That's not fair. them behind. Contradictory messages from me. This is an enemy? I don't know. <laughs> okay. Oh, I see, I see. These are connected. Okay. Let's go ahead and end the day. Oops. End it. End the day. Captain Olimar, I'm currently stranded on an unknown planet in the far reaches of space. Oh, yeah. Please send help as fast as you can. Oh, so. I can only hope this distress signal reaches the rescue corps. Four days left. Okay. All right. 
Let's get our Pikmin out. We'll go with that. And then we're gonna go up here. And let's write this guy. Does it go all the way down? Or does it just keep going up? No, it goes all the way down. Come on. take care of this guy. Oh, look at me! Oh, look at me! Ow, don't fall off! Oh, no! Just, I don't know if I can tumble him over. Where are you guys? The Pikmin are fighting for their life up there. All of those. You guys can work on that. White gate now open? Oh, hi! Hello! <laughs> Welcome! What? Why are you in water? For the follow, my name or the name still appear backwards, so it's something I still have to fix. So I'm sorry about that. Hello, relic and and sofa and alley cat. Welcome. I want to take care of this guy. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, 
Okay, yeah, I totally understand. No worries. But thank you for stopping by, Alley Cat. I definitely don't want to spoil you. Oh, shoot. We just... guys can go this way now. Alright, that's fine. Just go back up. I don't know. How do I? Oh, maybe this one. Oh, there's just a guy. Okay. That's it from over here? I'm not sure. Um, but we will just flop down. Our ship is looking good so far. Um, I guess I don't need any more raw material. America, pew pew! <laughs> For that, um, that enemy. <laughs> I 
think this is where I have to go. I don't know if I'll be able to make it, but... You can see. I don't know where the last... Oh, it's in there. should just oh I forget I don't have a base here let's go let's go mm, I don't think we'll be able to make it but I can get it as close as possible for <laughs> the next day. I think that should be it though. Um, I'll end the day, that's fine. A lot of ship parts this time around. Balloon. Only three days remain, and my efforts to collect all my ship parts are paying. Ship parts are paying off. If I can keep collecting the parts I need at this rate, I'll be home soon enough. It's fine. We have so much time. We have more than. More than enough time. My life support system will run out in three days. I can't afford to dilly dally. I only have one thing, Elmar. Come down. but <laughs> I need you to pick up the thing. Thank <laughs> you. 
Was that like a pillow so he could sit on in there? Oh, it's so shiny now. Yay! I've done it! I've done it! SS Dolphin is fully prepared. Finally, I'll be able to escape this planet. The time has come to head home. I'm going back to Hokute. Back to my family. Oh, that was... okay. We're just... I thought I could still do stuff. <laughs> I'm so confused. Bye, my friends. I don't know what happens after this. I don't know if he... If he crashes or if he comes back because moths... I think that's what he said happened. Takeoff was a success, but as I exited the planet's atmosphere, I realized that Moss had snuck onto the ship and she was clearly suffering. Oh, he didn't take Moss. I rushed to turn the ship around and tried to land. But at that very moment, my life support system failed. Oh, but I ha you had two more days. Okay. <laughs> I guess the Pikmin knew something we didn't. I don't... <laughs> yeah, sure. Yay! Oh, it just tells me, like, everything I did in a day. Okay. So that's the story of how I was pulled back to this planet. And how I lost my life support systems and woke up as a leafling. I appreciate you taking the time to listen to the entire harrowing tale. Thanks to you, I've been able to remember so much. When I first became a leafling, I remember seeing a very interesting looking cave. It must be around here somewhere. Ooh, a cave? Oh, what? Was that always there? Hector. I wonder if this is the cave he was talking about. While Olimar was recounting his adventures, I spotted the entrance to a cave right, he right here. Kokji. For whatever reason, our radar never picked up on it. That must be why we didn't know it existed until now. What could be inside? I don't know. I don't know. I had the strangest dreams lately. There's this white leafling standing in front of that cave saying, Come and become my apprentice. You shall be rewarded. Okay, bye. <laughs> it's a, is it a dandiri? Oh gosh. I have time. Maybe I can tackle it. Yeah, I will go into the mysterious cave.
First story, bull blacks. First story, bull blacks. First story. It's a three dandiri level one. How many stories does it have? Hmm, excellent. I've grown tired of waiting your arrival. Awaiting oh, your arrival. So you wish to become my apprentice. Say no more. I am able to see all. For I am what you might call the great master of the art of dandori. I will present you with ten stories. Oh. With each success, you may ascend to the next story in your climb to dandori greatness. Hmm. It's been a while since I've tested a newcomer. Perhaps a special reward is in order as well. Now let us begin your training. Okay, we're just gonna hop into it. That's fine. Oh, do I have to collect their bodies? I was thinking there was treasure. But that makes sense. The first level, first level is bull blaxes. I mean, I got bronze. Is that... Does that count? <laughs> I don't know. I'm very disappointed in you. Your dandiri abilities are far from impressive. I'm sorry. What do I have to get? Like, platinum? Gold? Go to overtime? What does that mean? Start. I don't know why I thought there would be treasure. We don't know if we can do this, to be honest. So I have to collect everything, right? Oh, wait, so do you just have to kill them? You don't have to collect them? Oh, that's different then. I thought I had to carry them all back. Yeah, I'm not reading. Okay, that's different. I saw the little um, count of creatures that you kill, but I thought, I don't know. I just assumed that you had to bring them back. Okay, that makes it a lot easier. So I don't have to focus on bringing them back. I don't have a clock phone. I don't even know. Oops. Ah. I don't know if they're praiseworthy. That's... I don't even know if I have to destroy this wall.
I did it. <laughs> yep. I don't even care. I got a bronze and I did it. Mm, you passed. I'll be waiting for you at the next trial. Thanks. It made it a lot easier that knowing that I didn't have to collect the bodies. I wasted a lot of time doing that. I don't like raw materials collected. Okay. Oh, shoot. I'm not about that guy. Ah, no! If they didn't get eaten... They would have made it. Dang it. <laughs> they were so close. Yes, it is a snow problem. What the heck? Build the bridge too? Oh, okay. So I wouldn't have made it either way. There are not the bridge, the climbing wall.
child. Oh, Jesus. That's what I get for trying to sneak past that guy. Run. We can do it, maybe. Oh, gee, you're in the way. Getting all bronze, but we're doing it. <laughs> you passed. We'll be waiting for you at the next trial. Proceed. Collect all the treasures. Okay, so this one collecting the treasures. This is gonna be difficult. <laughs> of course, I need like 50. <laughs> alright, alright, I see.
So close this time. Oh, maybe it wasn't. I don't know. I thought that was it, but I guess not. Does that guy have it? Dice, and I guess that guy has the other one because I don't see it. I'm so close. <laughs> Okay, one more time before I end it. My uh, ice pigment don't really pack a punch. But I want to see if this guy has the thing. No, he doesn't. So it's uh, I don't know where it is. Could have done it. Should I do one more time? I don't know where it is either. I have to have Ochi find it. All right, one more. This is the one. Where is it, Ochi? get everything? It says I'm missing one. I don't know where it is. Well, besides the melon. Alright, well. Okay, I'm gonna exit. I've only done three stories. So tomorrow we're gonna focus on these and then and then finish the rest of the story. I don't know. I didn't think that this would be part of everything, but save and go to the title screen because that is it for the day <laughs> you're a top-notch explorer 
to think that a wise and reclusive leafling was underneath the rescue command post this whole time. Are? From what I can tell, if you decide to enter that cave, you won't emerge until nightfall. Hmm, that means you won't be able to explore any other area later that day. This is a good example of how the art of dandiri is also crucial to your work as a rescue officer. Hey! That's right, make sure you take care of any outstanding rescue tasks before entering that cave, Embers. Turn back to the title screen. And this is where I'll leave off with it. But um, we'll come back in. Hopefully doing better next time. But um, thank you so much for watching and for joining. Um, that we will continue our adventure sometime in the next in the near future. <laughs>